tonight a brewing controversy pitting a local family versus police in Alexandria and this stems from when a car carrying family members in a funeral processional was pulled over near the intersection of Duke and South Walker streets. Jay Corp live near that intersection tonight. So Jay, why was he pulled over in the first place? Allison, he was pulled over because he went through that red light. But of course, the family argues that they were in a funeral procession and that should be OK. More on that. The big problem for the family is that this man was a pallbearer at a funeral, uh, at a burial service that he ended up missing. Ethel Fry, the matriarch of her family, passed away earlier this month at 96. Ronald Spinner is her grandson. She was definitely a role model for the family. But Spinner says her moving send-off last Thursday was tainted by a run-in with the law. The funeral procession was traveling down Duke Street, heading toward Mount Comfort Cemetery in Alexandria, when Spinner's daughter-in-law, Heather Spinner, saw a police cruiser approaching from behind. So my husband braked um, because we thought he would pass us in pursuit of whoever he was following. The Alexandria City officer pulled over her brother-in-law, R.G. Spinner, who was in a car behind her for running a red light at Duke and South Walker. Before the vehicles ever stopped, the yellow signs were being waved out that clearly said funeral in large black print. She says R.G. and her husband, both pallbearers, told the officer they were heading to a graveside burial, but the officer wrote R.G. a ticket anyway. They assumed being in a procession made it OK for them to go through a red light. As it turns out, in Virginia, you can only ignore traffic laws if you have a police escort, which they did not have. The spinners are outraged because they say the officer took so long to issue the ticket that Heather, her husband, R.G., and four others missed the burial. Now, I know safety is a concern, but uh, sometimes you can have a little sense of decency and understanding and compassion for the situation. The family would like an apology and that ticket, of course, dismissed. We don't know if that's going to happen. Alexandria City Police say they were reviewing that red light camera to see what happened, and then they and prosecutors will make a decision. Live in Alexandria, Jay Korf, ABC 7 News.